Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. 2018 Fireballs here, back with another MLB 9 Innings 23 video. We're with the Pirates team in today's video, and nothing new has really changed, uh, although I do have Adam Frazier batting first in my lineup now, as well as Brian Reynolds batting second. The pitching rotation is pretty much the same. Uh, Mitch Keller 2023's live diamond right here, as you guys can see. He's kind of fluctuated down a bit, so my overall dropped from a 95 to a 94. Looking forward to hitting that 100 overall, by the way. As soon as we can fill out all diamonds in our lineup and in our pitching rotation we're hoping we can do that today possibly uh, we'll get close i definitely know that but let me show you guys ryan reynolds and the train that he's working with not really impressive right now i kind of just got him to level 16 and i'll retrain him later i did land this pretty nice skill set though, though with spotlight and barrel it up and then adam frazier's playing second base and i got a pretty decent train right here uh, with good fielding i think this was actually from a redistribution ticket so for now i'm going to stick with it but eventually, since he already has high fielding and he's a second baseman, and second basemen don't need that much fielding, I'm probably going to retrain this later on. But I do like that he has I as one right now. And yeah, that's pretty much for the team. The pitching skills and stuff are the same. I am currently special training Joe Musgrove right now, so that will be done uh, as I cut when my packs and inventory get full. But let's start off here with these silver player packs. We have six of them. Not too many. Haven't been getting a lot of them lately on this team from Master League mode. Uh, since this team is a lower overall, it does take a little bit more to get certain packs uh, from Master Mode, but we'll work with what we have right here. Let's jump into these premium player packs, and we're going to do 50 of them like always, and we can see how many diamonds uh, are we going to pull. And with the Pirates, I think a uh, new card got added into the game, or a couple new cards. This is a little while ago. They got added into the game, including signatures, and AJ Burnett was one of those signature cards, so... Um, AJ Burnett is another great card for this Pirates team. He's actually the second best Pirates pitcher for the Pirates uh, currently. As we get our first diamond right here, let's pop this open. He's a 72 base overall, just behind Garrett Cole and his 2015 card. There's a Rugnet Odor right here. It's a pretty nice Texas card. Actually, his rookie year, so a um, little low on the power in the eye, but he does have, have some better years with Texas. Like I was saying about AJ Burnett, uh, Burnett had a great year in 2014. And then in 2015 with the Pirates, he also had a decent year, but I believe it's his 2014 card that takes the cake for the Pirates team because it's right behind Garrett Cole, he has a signature, and I really hope I can someday pull that card either out of Team Select Diamond Pack or a Sig Player Pack as we get our second diamond right here. And oh, okay, another Texas Ranger, 2021 Chase Anderson. Not a really good year for Chase Anderson right there. He had a good year in 2017 with the Milwaukee Brewers. So for Brewers teams, that's a good card to get. Uh, his 2018 isn't that bad as well. And there's Keith Hernandez right here, a vintage card. And I think that's enough for now. Let's do some special training. Okay, just finished special training. Let's do these premium vintage player packs here. We have three of them. Uh, legend chance is less than 1%, so I'm not expecting it. Yep, just three regulars as expected. And we get a Blue Jay, a Padre, and a Mariner. I actually have this Mariner Sig. Speaking of Mariners... Uh, I will eventually, based on your guys' poll, or based on the poll that I posted and your guys' decision, I will, in the near future, be making full videos for my Mariners team. So, thanks for uh, suggesting that. I read a comment, I forget who it was, but I, I think you know who you are. But Mariners team videos will be coming out soon. That's a big announcement uh, that I'm just letting you guys know right now. But Pittsburgh Pirates, here we go. Team selective, regular player packs, premium player packs. Let's see if we can get any BD material, upgrade, or diamonds. Uh, so no diamonds out of this first one. We do get a Josh Bell, though. That's BD right there. Melanson we don't need because we have his SIG. And there's the AJ Burnett I was talking about right there. Um, this is his 2015 one, which is a decent card, but this is not his best year. Let's do 10 more of these. No diamonds out of these next 10. All right. Any special cards? Oh, in fact, all silvers. So upgrades, anything here? look like it harrison and mccutcheon i'll be able to save as well as Marte. and here we go with the last one who we're going to get out of this it's not a diamond and it's just a silver all right and it's a castro and i've noticed that the pirates don't have a lot of good cards uh, no matter where you split it so it's kind of like you kind of got to expect to get bad cards most of the time for this team 
but we have 32 gold player packs right here let's see how many um special cards we can get and i gotta say gold player packs are money for when it comes to special training gold cards are great for special training so i'm loving the event that's going on and i think i've expressed that before in previous videos there's an excellent devin williams right there his incredible 2020 season card right there 12 more of these let's see if we can get a prime i did get a prime out of a gold player pack in one of the last couple videos nothing out of these 30 right here though looking like uh it's gonna be a, a dud as far as gold player packs go last two maybe prime all right no prime so all normal golds which is not a bad thing we'll pour all this into special training and it'll get our team upgraded nicely all right live season ultimate player pack let's pop this one open is it going to be a diamond nope just a gold okay and we're going to look who it is maybe a pirate uh i thought it was a pirate had the same colors but it's a prismat for the padres uh probably not going to be in the major leagues for long if he keeps pitching like that all right let's do these regular nine ultimate player packs hold that thought actually okay now let's do the nine ultimate player packs here how many diamonds are we going to see out of these all right at least one and it's just one all right maybe a pirate no we get a johnny lasagna as uh jad calls him jonathan loisiga 2021 card had a good year that year with the yankees i'm uh, not sure if he's still playing for the yankees but oh another thing the trade deadline how could i forget it's it's this is august 1st when i'm recording this video but the trade deadline uh wasn't as exciting as i i, I thought it was gonna be but still um max scherzer got traded justin verlander got traded uh, so many different things happened let me know what you guys think about the justin verlander trade uh i think it was a uh, kind of a dumb deal for the astros i think the astros kind of gave up a bit too much for uh an aging verlander but who knows the verlander might click and he might get back to his 2019 self as we get justin wilson right there that's actually a nice card oh I thought it was his other year. It's 2013 or 15 card, I think, is better. But still, it's a diamond that I don't have that will add to the set deck, so I'll be happy with that. that that'll be sufficient for now, and eventually he will be replaced with a better uh, team diamond. But let's go batter with this second one just because uh, I want to try and get uh, an even amount. So let's try and get a diamond batter that I don't have to put on the bench. So here we go, Pirates batter. Uh, I would like a really good card too that I don't have. I don't just need a 50 base overall, but I'll take whatever I get here as long as it's not a do. Collins. I don't think I have Collins, and it's a terrible card, but like I said, I'll take it. It's going to be on the bench, and with this Pirates team, you can't be too upset about having bad cards on your team because it's kind of expected. But here we go. Let's, oh man, I missed the Ultimate Team Selector Pack. Let's do this one. Can we get a diamond out of this one? Maybe we can get a third diamond, maybe? Nope. Alright, it's going to be a gold. Uh, but we have the live, not the live wish, but the ultimate wish player pack as we get another Wilson. I don't think he has a sig for the pirates, so this is not like a foreshadowing of me pulling a Wilson sig. I don't even think he has any sigs for any team. But uh, ultimate wish player pack right here. We're going to go for uh, Garrett Cole because he has the best pitcher card um, for the pirates. Let's go by ability. So as you guys can see here, Garrett Cole 2015, 73 base overall. And then uh, looking at Adrian Burnett, uh, it's actually his 2013 card. He, I think he played for a different team in 2014. I could be wrong, but 2013, I, I misspoke earlier. This is the second best Pirates pitching card out there. So hopefully I can eventually get that. But we're going to try and go for a Diamond Cole. I did not get any Diamond out of all my other teams that I used this pack on. So hopefully today... Colby Diamond, please. Nope, I think it's only like a 5% chance or 10% chance or something too, so not a big deal. We get Garrett Cole right here though, so we'll keep that in the backups for when I actually get his Diamond. But let's do these All-Star player packs here. I haven't gotten a team card on any All-Star packs, and we don't get any Diamonds, so let's see if we can get a Pirate out of these Golds. Nope, we get Ramirez and Soto. I feel like I get the exact same All-Star cards every single time. I don't know what it is, but I feel like I don't get like a variety. I always end up pulling the same all-star cards. But all right, here we go. Two SIG player packs right here, and we will do SIG combos if these aren't two Pirates cards, which I would really appreciate if they were. Uh, I actually don't have a great increase on me right now. So I don't know, probably have to wait till the offseason because it's a free-to-play team. But here we go. Two SIG player packs. Is it a diamond? 
No, none of them are diamonds. All right. One's gold, one's silver. Let's start off with silver on the right. Joey Votto, 2021. That's actually a cool card right there. I like that card art. Uh, his resurgence here that he had a couple of years ago. Uh, again, a Cincinnati Red. I apologize to you, Cincinnati Red cards or Cincinnati Red teams. I keep pulling Cincinnati Red cards, so that's kind of unfortunate. Uh, I know I pulled Luis Castillo in my last video, but here we go. Left side, gold, pirate, please. Ah, Philly, Harper 21. Man, that's an excellent card. Wow. 73 base. That is massive. So two massive hitting cards right here. Ooh, okay, let's go and get into combos, though. Okay, so we have enough stars to do an all-star combo, so I'm going to do that and get that out of the way first. We'll do Michaelis, Soto, and Ramirez. 500 stars. Let's see what we get. Pirate, please. No, oh, we get Aaron Judge 17. So I got Otani in the last video, and we get Aaron Judge this time. I'm going to look at that card in the uh, player reserves. I think I, I'm pretty familiar with it, but I just want to show you guys. Amazing power, amazing contact. Uh, one of the best all-star cards out there. Probably better than Otani's hitting card, to be honest. But, man. Wish I could just get a team all-star or something, you know what I mean? But, could totally make up for it with a team sig right here. We'll do Renfro, Barlow, and Harper. And then we'll save Votto for the next time. Coming away these in 3, 2, 1. Another Detroit Tiger. Um, Again, for some reason, Cincinnati Reds and... Detroit Tigers seem to be the theme. And this is a new SIG. I'm pretty sure this was added just a couple months ago. Um, because he only had a vintage just a little while ago. But man. I keep pulling other... I keep pulling Tigers and Reds SIGs. And I just don't know why. Should I, make a uh, should I make a Tigers team, guys? Is that what I need to do? Do I need to make a Tigers or a Reds team now? I don't have the time for that. But we're going to throw Wilson in the lineup. And then I'll show you guys the new changes in the next video. Thank you guys for watching though. If you did enjoy this video, please leave a like down below, hit share and subscribe. Feel free to check the description box down below for my Instagram and my Reddit. I post MLB 9 innings content there weekly and I know you guys would enjoy that content. Also, I have a Discord server in the description box. Feel free to join that uh, where we talk MLB 9 innings uh, all, the all the time, all day. And uh, it's a great place to hang out with me and the rest of the 9 innings community. But with all that said and done, that's going to do it for me. I'm going to end the video right here. You guys have a great rest of your day. God bless you guys. Jesus loves you. I will see you all in the next video.